Autologic's Drive Pro Asian Diagnostic Software for Honda vehicles has a built-in function test for anti-lock brake wheel speed sensor testing. This test can speed the diagnosis of a possible faulty wheel speed sensor with a non-intrusive test method. Begin by identifying the vehicle you're working on. Turn the key on with the engine off. Select Done. Select Detect Automatically VIN Read. Select Enhanced Powertrain. Select Brakes. Select Anti-Lock Brakes. Read and Understand Warning. Select OK. Select Service Functions. Select Tests. Select Pulsar Test. Select Start. Select Back and next to select the wheel you wish to perform the pulsar test on. In this example, we'll select the left front wheel. Select Done. Read and understand instructions on screen. Lift and safely support the front axle of the vehicle so both wheels spin freely. The engine should be off, transmission in neutral, and parking brake released. Select Next. Put a piece of masking tape on the uppermost part of the tire, center top. Select Next. Rotate wheel slowly and stop when the counter value is 1. Mark the fender using masking tape at the location of the masking tape on the tire. Select Next. Rotate the wheel in the opposite direction and stop when the counter value is 3. Mark the fender using masking tape at the location of the masking tape on the tire. Select Next. The position in the middle of tape positions 1 and 2 is the start position. Align the tape on the tire with the start position. Mark fender at start position with tape. Select Next. Rotate wheel one full revolution and stop at the start position. Record target pulse counter value and pulse counter value. Select Next. Test is now complete. Target pulse value and pulse value should match. If the values do not match, there could be foreign material on or near the sensor tip or a faulty sensor. The values on our subject vehicle do not match. With a fault in the sensor signal confirmed using diagnostic software, we can now confidently test the sensor signal using a scope. Our subject vehicle, a 2009 Accord, is equipped with magneto-resistive wheel speed sensors. These sensors produce a digital signal. A functional sensor should produce a signal as shown, a digital square wave ranging from about 10 volts to 11.5 volts DC. The signal should begin to generate as soon as the wheel is moved from a stop. On our subject vehicle with the faulty sensor, the digital signal drops out for long periods of time during wheel rotation, as indicated here.